uh, Digit Ledge subsea was spawn out of frustration of the, the kit that we were using basically and I was I was on a job and had this idea about linking dive logs to digital video. It wasn't revolutionary, there was similar systems out there, but nothing for the ROV guys, it was mainly for the inspection guys. So we got together with a programmer, spent 12 months um, developing the system, and we came up with the Edge DVR, and we started the company off on very little money, and luckily one of my friends over in Brunei um, bought the first two systems and of course we used that money to propel the company even further and that was 10 years ago now so um, it's been a been a journey and uh, we've continued to develop the system and now we've got our new system just coming out now so just in time for the hopefully the end of the downturn and the upsurge of the industry. We've come to OGA this year um, off the back of basically we, it's the first time that we've done it over in Malaysia um, we did uh, the oil and gas exhibition in Singapore in November, which was quite busy. So therefore, when the opportunity came up to, again to be in the UK Pavilion in, in Kuala Lumpur, uh, we took the opportunity because the industry is again on the rise and um, we don't have as much uh, market penetration over here as what we would like. So therefore, that's why we're here this year and it's been quite a busy show up to now and I hope it continues. Being part of the UK Pavilion helps us out um, quite a lot actually, um, they give you quite a lot of support on the day obviously for setting up etc. If you need any consulate help, they're, they're, they're very well connected with the ambassadors and, and the consulate staff over in uh, the country that, that we exhibit with. I've done probably five or six exhibitions now as part of the UK Pavilion. Um, and it's been great every time and it's also promoting British products which is which is also cool.